green flag is waving for night two of the Sage Fruit Skagit Nationals. Racing into turn one, David Gravel with the early lead. Donnie Schatz challenging on the inside of the speedway. James McFadden making moves down low already up into the fourth spot behind teammate Brad Sweet. Gravel leads the opening circuit. McFadden to the inside of the big cat. J-Mac third for the moment. Sweet right back to the inside as they race into quarter number three. Close quarters action between the teammates at Casey Kate racing with Mike Kerb. Jack Eckert into the infield. Brian Boswell doing the same. We stay under green flag conditions as David Gravel starts to pull away from the field. Lead back underway in the Seafoam restart zone. Donnie Schatz jumps up to the cushion in one and two, looking for a run on leader. David Gravel, he's making ground up down the back straightaway. Shots to the inside in three and four. Battle for the lead out of turn number four. David Gravel has him, but Donnie Schatz is right there with him. Gravel now to the cushion in one and two. Brad Sweet works the bottom of the racetrack there, hoping to gain ground on the race leaders. His teammate James McFadden right on his back bumper into corner number three. Brad Sweet's got another run down the inside of the back straightaway. He'll take second again into turn number three. James McFadden right there as well. McFadden out of the inside of shots to take the third spot. David Gravel leading slower car. Malachi Gimmer between he and the second place machine of Brad Sweet. Shots coming right back at McFadden for the third spot down low in turns three and four. And now Sheldon Hodenshield is part of that mix. It's one and two. They are side by side. And the big cat takes the lead exiting the second corner. Gravel goes right back to the high side in three and four. Slower car trips up in front of him and Brad Sweet will lead lap number 22. Brad Sweet leading it. David Gravel second, but now two slower cars between the first place machine and the second place car. Donnie Schatz now looks to the inside of James McFadden trying to steal the third spot back. Seven laps to go with the Skagit Speedway. Shots to the inside, but McFadden down low to slam the door. McFadden and Gravel now side by side for the second spot down the back straightaway. They'll stay wheel to wheel into turn number three. James McFadden takes the second spot from David Gravel, and Donnie Shots comes with him into third. And now Shots takes second as they bang wheels at the end of the front straightaway. Sheldon Hodgson makes it nearly three wide for third with David Gravel and James McFadden. Donnie Shots second behind Brad Sweet. This time by five laps to go for the big cat. Looking for his first career Skagit Speedway World of Outlaws NOS Energy Drink Sprint Car Series feature win. Shots second. Gravel now and McFadden side by serve for third. Gravel's got the spot again into turns three and four. Sheldon Hodden, she'll try to turn it underneath. J Mac, they'll go side by side in traffic down the front straightaway. Good stuff between the 9 and the 17. Logan Schuhart making his presence known late in this one as he slides up in front of Carson Macedo to take the sixth spot. Leader down the back stretch into three and four. White flag will wave for the Casey Kane racing with Mike Kerb number 49. Casey Kane from Enumclaw, Washington. He owns the winning car from last night. And he owns another winning car this evening at the Skagit Speedway. Brad Sweet wins night two of the Sage Fruit Skagit Nationals. Donnie Schatz finishes second. David Kramer. Thanks, baby. The big cat climbs up top of the VP Fuels checkered flag to celebrate his first ever Skagit Speedway World of Outlaws win. For live coverage of every World of Outlaws series event and for extended on-demand race content, visit DirtVision.com. For full race results, highlights, and series news, visit WorldOfOutlaws.com.